What we have here is the phone charging dock that's in the new Model S. Um, this also has the shifter and the emergency hazard flasher capacitive buttons on the bottom of it. I've already taken this one apart. There's a panel here with uh, a bezel for the lights, the LEDs, and then uh, a flat flex with the capacitive sensors on it. That goes to a little board here with a uh, 48 megahertz ARM Cortex M0 made by Cypress that's doing the capacitive sensing and talking on the CAN bus. Um, there's a CAN transceiver here and a choke, some LEDs. Looks like there's also a light sensor for ambient light. And that's the termination. And then inside the actual phone charging thing, there's two things going on here. We have this top board, which actually has an NFC radio in it. And this is where you hold your card um, if you're starting the car without your fob or your phone. So you hold the card up to here, and so there's a NFC antenna in here. And then this is the actual phone charger. It says this is a 16 watt plus 16 watt charger. And interestingly, they have two coils offset, probably so that phones with different height coils can still charge reliably. Very interesting design. M much higher quality than you typically see in these wireless chargers. Interesting look at how Tesla continues to lead in electronics. 